Hey, what's up, guys? Demo14 here. Um, uh, recording's very late because I, um, huh, it was weird. Like, for some reason, I guess I didn't, I don't think I hit end when I finished talking to y'all, so, um, it kept going, and so that's why stuff happened. Um, yeah. Uh, but, but basically, that's why I'm not uh, recording from the beginning. Um, but basically, he said post maximum crisis in the post, so I was like, okay, well, let's see how this does against that meta, and <laughs> we'll have to see. Um, brainwashing beam will be n could be nice. Um, it'll depend exactly when um, tar you can target one other level four damage cards to be able to destroy it. This will show my dark. That's whatever, um, honestly. If I steal that, then. Well, A, I think it would even resolve. Um, because it's on the field, so it would still, still resolve, and I would still, um, die, so... <laughs> yeah. But basically, I'm gonna get wrecked. I mean, I drew into two shock troopers, which makes the rescue rabbit in the hand dead. So this is essentially three dead cards, and all I have is alien kid and, um, uh, brainwashing beam. Um, yeah, which is nice. But, um, no, it's fine. Again, I don't know what in the world I'd do with that, so... No. And also, um, a lot of characters you remember the card or that muster. Okay. Um... So I think he's gonna go into Danglon here. And search, uh, Nine Burns is the Yang thing. Um... I guess I want to steal this and then have it die. Scar is destroyed by Carpex, just from a non Earth Worm type monster from your Greybird. So that is live. Oh, he's gonna go BFD. Um, okay, let's see. Dorian did this as he activates that. I'm gonna have to chain a. Um, I could, but then he's just gonna chain the effect anyway. Um, uh, I'm gonna flip it here. Like, I guess I could wait, but like, then he's just gonna. Oh, wow, really? Um, so. Yeah, I'll activate the effect, please, and thank you. I don't know why. Um, I'll detach. I guess I'll detach Danlon. Um, let me see his grave. Hold on. What could be... Uh, I would say fire, but, like, at the same time... Uh, oop, I'll just say earth. I don't know. I don't think it matters. Um, I think in some stasis it'd be activating stuff from Grave it does, but, um, in this case I don't think it doesn't. Unfortunately, um, oh, we're in each of my end phases? Oh, yo, this is, wow, I can't believe we didn't even realize that, this is lit. Except for the fact that he just went Tornado Dragon on me, and now, um, he's gonna pop the back row and wreck. Oh, wait, he can't activate the effects. That's right, he can't activate the effects. Why can't you attack? What? Oh wait, yeah, they can't attack because of VFD. Um, I'll activate this then. Yeah, I don't know who had priority on that, so if I mess it up, that's my bad. Um, uh, sure. Okay, so we have this, and then Ellie and Dollar to get two counters on stuff. Um, but it's basically you're gonna need a rank four to do that. And Okay, I have Topia Lightning. I was gonna say, sure, we don't have Topia Lightning, you dingus. Um the only thing is it's only gonna be able to deal with one of these. Um, which does suck. Mm. Does he have to get the ability? Damn it. Why? Why do we design some of these car alien cars to not get the ability? to, um, decrease attack and such. Um, he still has a counter on him. I guess I'll put one on here, and I don't think it matters, but one on there. Um, 
because I have no way. I only have one rank four play, and like, already normal summoned. So I could go Overlord, but like, why? Like, what would be the point of that? Like, I guess maybe I'll put the two counters in here. 300, 900. That still wouldn't be enough to get over. Um, yeah. So I guess I could go Dark Rebellion. Actually, that's my that's my out. That's 100% my out, is Dark Rebellion. Yeah. Um, not even joking, this, it's 100% my out. 100% um, my out to this is, ish. Um, yeah, so attack over that. So I don't want that. Um, uh, what is this again? Restore him to change the face on. Yeah, don't want to deal with that. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so now I have a 4250 uh, Dark Rebellion, but he has this is still alive, he has this is still alive, it's still, obviously, still not looking good. Um, and then these two cards in my hand are basically dead. So yeah, and now he's destroying that, which is he's doing special summon, I guess, Agnizad. I guess that's the only one in his grave. Um, and he has an Agnizad in hand now. So he can potentially go into another VFD. Um, and yeah, that's what we like to call a uh, a problem. Um, yes, yes indeed, we call that a kind of, sort of, big problem. Okay, so he's going to pop, I guess, well, I don't know what he's going to pop. Tornado Dragon and what? Oh, and another, wait, he had two of those in hand? Wow. Unless I'm missing something, that's just kind of nuts. Um, and so now, yeah, now he has another VFD, and then he um, can help special summon something from Grave. Or from Deck, sorry. And go into, probably go into the other one in hand. Um, okay. Wait, you know what? Yeah, sure, you have VFD, but how do you get over this thing? Is there something I'm missing? Um, oh, boy. Yep, okay. This is special summon any dinosaur? Yeah, that's, that's that's what we call a problem because um, now we can destroy a monster in Handra Field and then flip everything face down the fence and then he's just going to beat the heck over me. Um, with all of that. And then next turn I'm going up against a VFD. Or, or yeah, you can just send my monsters to Earth and then he can pop both of them, right? This is like, uh, yeah. Okay, that's GG. I'll let him OTK me, but... Um... Yeah, so... So this is how this deck does again in Maximum Crisis format. Um... Like... <laughs> not so great. Um, yeah, let me... Finish with the warm crack. Hope he doesn't uh, rage quick. This would be a good single to show, though. I mean, I guess that... Um, Ill control... Uh, loses to True King Dinos game, game one. Um, all right. He's here. It looks like he's sticking around. Okay. Um, change his appearance, I'd say for sure, uh, cause he has a lot of those mini monsters. Um, flying C, but again, that doesn't really stop him. Uh, Band played on. Yes, absolutely. Uh, Mirabos, yes. So I'll drop a flying C. Drop fly more. I guess it changes appearance. <sighs> um, why don't we drop a brainwashy beam, scatter cell, alien kid, and freak sake, shake, choke. Yeah. Um, I guess a band to play on. I hate signing so much. All right. Let's see how we do game two, y'all. And this inherently sucks. Um. Hmm. He's gonna suspect something, but like, I don't have a choice because. I don't have a choice. Like, <laughs> uh, this pollutant virus can become very, very um, useful in a little bit. And by a little bit, that probably mean like this turn. So, and the next turn, I have access into a sync five place, so that would be nice. But um, yeah, okay. So he's gonna destroy a card in hand. So destroy that. Add a card. Um, so yeah, I mean, these cards, I mean, unfortunately I got a rarity bump, but that's a Konami thing to do. But I mean, these cards are 
basically going to be, um, <laughs> I mean, all the variants are basically going to be tier zero. I think, well, so I guess like technically if you really distinguish the variants, it's different decks, like no deck will be tier zero. But um, yeah, I think the first couple of weeks um, after Maximum Crisis drops, and that, this just sucks using two Israel spells in one turn. Um, so, uh, what's it, sorry, um, where was I trying to stop? This is the first couple of, like big events um, and regionals, and then I guess the first YCS after Maximum Crisis drops is probably going to be determining like, okay, which variant's the best. Um, what's this, take one there, whatever. Um, Again, I got my plant pollutant virus. Um, okay, once we turn during our player's main phase, I might have to saw him strike that, which sucks. Uh, this is gonna for someone. Okay, whatever. That's fine. Um, again, that's fine. Um, yeah, but it's gonna fight the the first competitive competitive events. Oh my goodness, you're just way too much, aren't you? Oh, you know, I could have. I could have done this and then forced him into a bad play. I don't know why I didn't do that. Um, oh shit, no, 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 no. Damn, he gets the effect, doesn't he? Shit. Uh, no, whatever, it's fine. He managed Stardust, Norden, so this is dead, and then um, Omega, that sucks. Um, okay, wait, 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 no, damn it, no! Um, I really don't want to saw him strike that. Um, he's not activating the effect. Oh, uh, I'll plant pollutant virus there. Oh yeah, he does get an effect. Doesn't he? Needs to add a card to hand, but I got this strike to back me up. So um, I'm thinking that should be good. Um, so presumably, oh shit, the special summons him. Damn, that just sucks. Um, that just really sucks. Oh boy, and then that's gonna special summon something from deck. Um, I don't know, maybe I, yo, know, maybe I should just wait until bow phase before. Um, if, yeah, maybe I should just wait until bow phase before um, activating that. That might have been the correct play. Wow, wait, 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 you opened all three terraforming. That's some bullshit right there. That is some 100% bullshit. Wow. That's just stupid. Yeah, I should have waited until battle phase. Wow. He didn't draw anything, did he? No, he's not drawing. Did he just open three terraforming? What the hell is this? Um, yeah, that'll strike. Um, so basically means he can go off now. With Norton gone, I have no play for next turn. Um, wow. Ugh, wow. Um, so I'm gonna be at 1500 now. Yeah, I think I should wait until battle phase, um, to do that. Or, are, are you serious? You couldn't have showed up like... Ugh. So the thing is, I can normal summon this. That's game, because... You tax over this with some something, make sure I get two counters and then tax for game. I'll play it out, but like... Um... Yeah, that just sucks. Like the only way I survive is for some reason I arrive until next turn, but that's not going to happen. Yeah, he's going to attack with that. He's going to get two counters. Um, but then he's going to attack for game. And yeah, that's GG. Um, so alright, cool. Got another match in, but at the same time, it was kind of, uh, kind of a, you know, this point, like, I guess the second isn't live maximum crisis format, but damn, true can dials are a P. Uh, I, I was, I, I liked how I had some advantage here. I think that was a misplay with Plant Pollutant Virus. I should have just waited until battle phase. Or until you like twin twisted um, the back row or like somehow threatened my ammonite. Um, but yeah, also you opened three terraform, which is stupid. Um, anyway, uh, alien control. 
um, gets 2 would by two clean dinos. Um, alright, so, another loss, but it's kind of an expected one. But, um, hey, uh, thanks so much for watching, guys. Um, please like, comment, subscribe, we're gonna go, con continue to grow the channel. Um, uh, links will be in the description below to, uh, various playlists. Um, you get ranked and ranked matches, you get deck profiles, um, general nerd discussions and reviews as well. Like, it's also my 2017 Phantom Movie Terror playlist of all the trailers from Phantom uh, movies. I'm at least someone interested this year. Um, they're all there. You just sit, uh, click one, uh, click where you want to start, and just sit back and watch and enjoy them all. Um, you probably have to keep going around the different pages and such. Um, yeah, and uh, again, please don't forget to subscribe and subscribe. And thank you so much to 21 people who have the time to film this uh, video. Have already subscribed. Sus subscribe. Um, uh, music again, courtesy of Bobby Sano, this soundtrack is called Toiling, um, link will be in the description, will be in the description below the SoundCloud channel, please check them out and, uh, check us out, tracks out there and support them there, but other than that, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see y'all next time.